the DTM in 1988. Ford, BMW and Mercedes-Benz fought it out for supremacy in German touring car racing. It was also the maiden season for AMG Mercedes, later to become HWA in 1999 and the most successful team in series history to this day. Prior to the season, Hans-Werner Aufrecht transformed what was previously just an engine supplier into a fully-fledged team and immediately hit the headlines by signing a former motorbike world champion and Formula One driver. Johnny Cecotto stepped onto the German motor racing stage in 1988. He soon silenced the skeptical voices with a double victory at the Avos in Berlin. At the penultimate race meeting of the season, the DTM's first and up to now only visit to the Hungaro ring, the Venezuelan claimed pole position. His teammate Kurt Team lined up alongside him on the front row. The Dane, not hired by Aufrecht until mid-season, would remain loyal to the Swabian team until 1991. The AMG pair made best use of their optimal starting positions in race one and posted the team's first 1-2 victory in the DTM. Cecotto ultimately took the checkered flag ahead of team. In race two, Klaus Nitzwitz managed to squeeze his Ford Sierra Cosworth in between Cecotto and the Dane. However, he could not prevent Cecotto making it back-to-back -back victories and prompting wild celebrations among the entire team. Budapest in 1988 was not only a premiere for the DTM in Hungary, it also launched a hugely successful AMG Mercedes era in the DTM. <laughs> 